guys, it's Lizzie. Welcome back to the channel. Today, guys, we are once again looking at more videos of haunted dolls slash toys caught moving on camera. There has seriously been so many terrifying videos of haunted dolls and other toys caught moving on camera that literally just, they blow my mind. I don't know if they're real or not, but these are the kind of videos that make me question every toy that I own and make me double take the fact that I have a whole shelf of haunted dolls in my house. So we're gonna be looking at these scary videos of creepy toys, but before we get started, be sure to smash a like if you guys like these videos and subscribe to join the Spooky Squad. I post new videos every single week and I don't want you guys to miss out on it, but let's get looking at these videos of creepy toys and haunted dolls caught moving on camera. Scary internet videos that will give you insomnia. Well, it looks like I will not be able to sleep tonight. Let's take a look at this first video of, is that a haunted car toy? All right, is that gonna be the, the culprit? All right. Braylon? No Braylon? way. What's happening with your car? No, this kid's toy car is moving. <gasps> Stop, the door just opened? Ooh. Oh my gosh, wait, now this chair? Hey, that ain't even a toy, that's a whole chair right there. Oh my gosh. Look. That's so creepy. I hate when rocking chairs <laughs> just move on their I own, because it's like, you know here. somebody used to sit there. That was their chair, they claimed that spot, and they're just like, hey, I'm just coming back for a good time, you know? Just showing y'all that I'm still here and I still claim that chair. Wait a minute. Oh, I'm not liking this. Ooh. Oh, wow. Wait. I swear I can see. <gasps> oh my god, there's a shadow moving! Stop, did you guys see that? It's a haunted chair! Let's go to dinner or something for a while. Oh my god, yeah, he's like, I need to leave the house. It started with a haunted car toy, and now it's just escalating to just haunted houses. What is going on? I need to know. Now I'm intrigued. <laughs> this guy's kitchen is terrified. Oh Shut my god. Up. What? How did that door handle? Oh, there's a haunted doll. That one's just blinking all on its own? What the heck? Caught two of my dolls moving? Oh heck no. Okay, seriously though? These are the kind of videos that like don't let me sleep at night. Like, I'll watch these. I'll stay up late watching scary TikToks like this, and then I won't be able to go to bed. Toy Story is real. <gasps> what was Woody doing? Can I just walk into Why are there so much? Okay, seriously, I've seen so many videos of just, like, haunted Toy Story dolls moving. Okay, what is this one? Oh, ew, its eyes moved! Stop, that last one? Ugh, I did not like that. Baby dolls already, like, freak me out, but that one was, like, too realistic looking for me, personally. Didn't like that. That was freaking terrifying. Okay, moving on to the next one. Creepy haunted dolls caught moving on camera. Okay, this one looks really, really creepy. Let's see what it's about. Never trust the dolls, it says. There's a swimming doll. How is it swimming? It's literally doing a whole backstroke in the water. It's that same one that I just saw. Ew, I hate that. I seriously like what I was just saying is it's so creepy. Ew. Okay, what is that? That's another haunted Woody! What is up with Woody? He's literally on the loose! Oh my god, I hate these videos so much. Okay. Which doll am I looking at? The one she's playing with or the one sitting on the ground? Oh, it's the one in the corner. Do you guys see it? It's moving. Its hair is like going up in the air. I don't like that. What is up with all these dolls being haunted though? Like. Seriously, like, a ghost can haunt anything, all right? I get that, like, dolls, like, resemble more of, like, a human being. I think that's why so many, so many of them have attachments. Oh my god. That is, like, the most creepiest doll. Is it gonna walk on its own? Oh, it's gonna walk, isn't it? I don't like that. Ew, it looked mad when that other girl grabbed it. Like, it didn't like that at all. Oh my god. It's too realistic looking. It literally looks like a real human child. Okay, I just don't like the look of that last one. Like, I've seen those dolls that, like, you hold their hand and then, like, they walk with you. And that's kind of, like, the whole concept. But, like, that does look like something that would get possessed by an entity. Just because it's, like, so out there. Doll caught moving on camera. Let's take a look. In the following video, a man named Jay is resting in his living room. When he okay. notices something strange about a doll that's placed on a high shelf. He that's takes a, doll? a closer look at this doll and is Ew. left deeply disturbed by what he captures. It's peeking like now, the doll out of the in this box. Video, according to Jay, was bought at a thrift store where two other dolls of the same brand were also being sold. No way. But for some unknown reason, this specific doll was hidden from the rest. 
Ooh. Jay suspects I have a doll the just like the doll that. was hidden from sight was because they didn't want anyone buying it. They were afraid this doll I literally might be cursed have the same or doll even almost. haunted. Now, Jay okay. wasn't really sure if this had been the actual reason, but after living with this doll for more than a year, it's That's become clear to him doll. that this may have been the case. Something isn't right with this doll. No, it just, While uh, it's just it's ugly. In room and watching over his child, Jay captures something on camera that leaves him extremely unnerved. What is it? Take a look. Okay, I'm watching this. I am full focus because I literally, I think I own the exact doll. I think, I Ew. think I can see it on here. Is it moving? Hold on. Okay, I'm watching yeah, really close. Oh, wait, there it is. It blinked! Did you guys see that? Comment see down below. Wait, it blinked, right? Am I seeing that correct? Is that what I... Oh my god, I'm like trying to watch this. Oh, it's moving its head. It's like tilting like that too. Ew! I don't like that. It literally went... Ee! Like, it turned its head. The only like solution or like thing I could say about that is what if it's one of those like music box dolls that like you wind up and like it tilts? Because I've seen a few of those. Maybe it was one of those. Because I did have a jester that wasn't music box. It looked just like that. Maybe that's debunked. I don't know, but that really freaked me out. Okay, this one says Robert the Doll's shocking blink caught on camera. In this 2011 video, some people believe that Robert the Doll can be seen blinking on camera. Oh man, Robert the Doll is terrifying to me. Like, I want to visit this doll. Oh my god, it did blink. It blinked. You're not supposed to record this doll at all, by the way. The original uploader never even mentioned or noticed the doll blinking in the How video. How did they not the notice blinking that? Was pointed out by YouTube commenters. Oh my who god. Watched the video and were shocked when that the Robert clearly doll blinked. To blink at the camera. Okay, seriously though, like that doll, if you guys don't know who Robert is, like he's known to just put bad curses on people or anybody who takes a picture or a video of him. Like, and then they have to write him a whole apology letter. I've made a few videos about Robert before, but seriously though, I, I just can't think about actually like going out of my way to record that doll and asking for a problem. Okay, this one says haunted doll caught on camera. Let's look. This security footage was taken inside a shopping mall in China. Oh. This toy buggy containing a doll seems to have a life of its own as it that travels across the That thing is literally like a RC. It's moving all on its own. So that's just like a shopping mall with a toy doll in it? I mean, the toy doll's in like the baby cart, but still. As a Ugh, child, I don't like that. The doll inside. It is too late for me Suddenly, right now to be watching the these. Starts to move within the no, don't stand up, girl. Sit back down. Sit back down. Stop it. Stop it, Annabelle animal? number two. We're Annabelle? An Annabelle? Prank. Oh, no. It better be a prank. That is way too lively. But there's like an orb flying. Stop. That better be edited. Comment down below. Do you guys think that's real? I'm really questioning these videos today. Like, some of these are just like out there like some of them are like okay I, I could believe that but this one i really just don't want that to be real <laughs> annabelle number two or annabelle's long lost sister okay this one just says haunted dolls all right let's take a look haunted timeout doll actually oh i hate those dolls those ones are so unsettling wait what is she doing okay is she pretending to be the doll i'm confused so the whole point of a timeout doll is it's supposed to look like a child in a corner that's left for a timeout. That's why they're positioned like this to be up against a wall, but they look freakishly real. So her haunted timeout doll is doing stuff in her house. Okay, I want to see what it's going to do. It's turning the lights on and off. If this is legit. Wait, it just... It literally just ran across the floor. Did you guys see that? It ran right here. No, it moved? Stop. Girl, you got yourself a haunted doll. The size of an actual child, too. Those are big dolls. Girl, you have a possessed doll. Time to go burn it. Time to go take it to, like, your local savers and cause chaos, okay? Not in the house. All right. I have no idea what this one is, but let's just get right into it. Oh! Oh! I think my haunted doll is trying to... Me! Fun! 
fun. It's just trying to make a grilled cheese sandwich. It's in the kitchen, you know. That's why it's by the, the knife stand, of course. No other reason. So he's locking it in the kitchen drawer. Okay, good idea. And then he's just gonna leave it right by the same knives. <gasps> Stop! Did he just talk? Bro, put the banana- Why would you throw bananas? That is absolutely cursed. I don't like that. Oh, let's lock him in a briefcase. Good idea. Why don't you go burn him on fire? Why don't you go donate him? Is he talking? Oh, in the trash. Okay, well, at least he's doing something reasonable. You'll regret this. You'll regret this. <laughs> the next day. Oh, hell no! Well, that was a very interesting event. A very interesting series of events. I don't know how to feel about that. Is that real? Probably not, but entertaining to say the least. Oh, he's back again. Look at this little thing. It actually is a really ugly doll though, to be fair. So I've had this doll, Garwin, since Garwin? four years old. It was a gift I received when my mom died. And it holds oh. a lot of sentimental value, but I had to get rid of it. Garmin. The past few nights I've been waking up to what sounds like a little boy crying in my basement. Bro. When investigating, I always find the Bro. propped up in completely different places. Get rid of Garwin right I now. I thought you did. Overnight to see what's moving it. And this is what I kept. He's so ugly. I don't like Garwin. I'm sorry. Is he going to do something? Why does he talk? Stop. Mama. 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 Oh. I don't like him. He goes, Mama. I hate Garwin. I'm sorry. This is why you can't just throw away a haunted doll. Why not? Oh, is it Garwin again? Bro, I thought you were getting rid of him after he goes, Mama! That would have been enough for me. Throw him away. Okay, this is the guy who owns Garwin, huh? Damn. Garwin's gonna come out of the trash, isn't he? Oh yeah, he just can't be thrown away. He's unstoppable. Can't be defeated. What's he gonna do? Oh. Wait, he's walking out of the trash. Okay, this is um quite the series of events once again. Oh, the basement. I hate basements. Oh, he's just sitting right there. How fun, Garwin came back inside to play, mama. Oh, don't grab him, please. He's gonna like shoot up for the camera and go rah, or something. Mama. mama. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that is. Why did he make like a birthing sound at the end? <laughs> Mama! It's honestly more funny than it is scary at this point. Okay, what is going on in here? Let's take a look. To the thief that stole these dolls out of the yard sale at three o'clock this morning, you're going to regret it. They're haunted. Huh? Had you waited till sunlight, you would have seen the sign that was under them that said haunted dolls. If you have children, please Ooh. don't buy. Them. Ooh. Okay, I'll put them in this glass hutch to try and contain whatever oh, was attached to them. No. It got so cold that it fogged up. What? Enjoy. No takes these backsies. Damn. And not to mention the only reason why I even sold them, had a yard sale to sell them, is because they threw a toy behind my baby and missed her head like that much. Oh my God. Like, They're aggressive. Sell them. Nobody wanted them because I warned everyone and showed them the videos of what these dolls do when they're in your vicinity. Oh my God. Because they were not scared to move right in front of you. No. Enjoy. So you're telling me somebody went out of their way to burgle, burgle, steal from this lady's garage sale and they ended up stealing very cursed possessed dolls. Well, Karma is a B, uh, B word. You know, Jojo Siwa's new album. Karma really got him. That is a wild story. Watch what happens when Sarah walks towards the clown and sits down. All right, this clown is known to drag people out of bed. All right, let's take a look. Okay. So that chair was just rocking on its own casually. That's enough for me to be like, yeah, no. She's just hanging out casually with these dolls. She has a recording device. So what she's doing right now is 
she's letting it be completely silent and she's recording anything that will pick up in real time. I'm gonna actually skip to here when she plays it back. So this is what she caught. She caught laughing from this doll. I don't know if you heard that, but it was going ha ha ha. That is terrifying. Like if it was completely silent and I was recording on audio and it was just laughing. Oh no, that thing would be gone out. I think look creepy in the first place. All right. Oh, not this. What is his name again? I already forgot his name. Not this dude again. Not this doll again. Capture my haunted doll crying on camera, producing real tears. Ain't no way. Okay, I'm waiting for the tears. Mama, where's the tears? Oh, oh, he's sad. Is his name Gerald or something? He's sad. He's sad. He's he's crying about his mama. <laughs> okay, he is so creepy though. Is he still crying? Bro has a whole waterfall falling out. Oh my god! Holy crap! Okay, is he good? Where'd he go? Where'd bro go? Somebody get that doll. Whoa! Oh, hell no! No, 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 no. I do not like this video. Not one bit. Oh, God. Okay. Get that doll. Get that doll away. Oh, is that a cat? What is the cat doing? Is that how the video is going to end? Okay, I've had enough. Footage you're about to see, a girl is given a pretty big doll as a gift. That thing is like a child-sized doll. At home. The girl talks in Spanish, presenting her newest toy. She also says that the doll is kind of ugly looking. And right when she says that, the doll moves its head. And she looks pissed at the doll like, off. No, but oh. seriously, it's pretty damn disturbing. Anyways, here is the video. Okay, I'm not ready for this. <laughs> it does turn! And then she freaked out and threw the thing. Oh gosh, that's cursed. Number four, the girl's evil doll. The girl's what evil doll. What you is a mom filming her daughter playing with her new toy that she wanted. The girl seems really happy and so does the mother seeing her daughter's positive reaction. But what they don't seem to see is the evil look in the background moving her arm gently towards the object. Can we talk about the video quality? All right, this has nothing to do with the dolls, but look how pixely it is. Because here, it's the video. Okay, I'm preparing. You like your new toy? <laughs> that thing looks creepy in the What's first place. What's his name? Lovable. What's his name? Lovable. Lovable, oh. Sure his name isn't Lovable. Very lovable. Fred or Henry. <gasps> oh, it got mad and it rolled the thingy. Because it didn't want to be called something sure else. his name isn't like Fred or Henry. Oh, it got mad at the mom. Oh, it's so cute. But then she called it cute. Possessed dog. What you're about to see is a video filmed by a YouTuber that has over 80,000 subscribers on his channel. Dang! When all of a sudden, the doll, the in, doll the in the back corner is just chilling. Leaving many people in the community stunned and uh, kind of creeped out. But yeah. enough of the talk. Here is the footage. I want to see this. So he's just talking and the doll is just chilling back there. Oh, his hand's moving! Oh my gosh, okay, yeah, I see the hand moving on the doll. It went up like this! How's that even physically possible? Like, there's nobody back there, so I don't understand the the physics of this. That's definitely cursed. Okay, yep, yep, yep. I saw it wiggle. Number two, the Nutcracker the doll. The Nutcracker this doll. This video shows a haunted Nutcracker. A haunted doll. Nutcracker. The family has had for <laughs> over 400 years from Germany. One of the family members decided to put a camera in front of the Nutcracker to see if the doll was actually. Haunted. That's an old it Nutcracker was though. Laughs and giggles. But look at what little they had to laugh about after recording this footage. Ready? Okay, I'm ready. I'm bracing myself. Wait, the mouth is moving on its own. What the heck? They're not even supposed to do that. They're supposed to be able to, like, you have to push the mouth down and, like, cut or crack the nuts. That thing was moving and now it's shaking? What the? It's a haunted Christmas doll! Now it's about to slide off. Oh, heck no. Yeah, there's something up with this thing for real. The dog's even looking at it in the corner. The dog was about to be freaked out. Doll. What Blonde you're about doll. To see is Same. a woman recording a YouTube video talking about her haunted dolls collection. Me! Yeah, we usually don't tend to hear. Anyway, <laughs> at various points in the video, a blonde-headed doll behind her moves completely on its own. There really? There will also be another clip shown from one of her other YouTube videos. Where that one thing of the is kind of interesting again. looking. Yeah, pretty unexplainable, but uh, here it is. Okay, I want to see this. So she's explaining her doll collection probably, and then the doll just moves. I'm watching the one in the corner, the blonde one. I'm trying to see what it's going to do. 
So it shifted all by itself. It's moving. Yeah, it's pushing into another doll. Okay, uh... Yeah, it's literally moving on its own! What the? Okay! Look at the one on the right of it, though. That one's even creepier than her. But she's haunted. Those were some spooky dolls. Okay, so there's some more haunted dolls we have to take a look at. Okay, I think we all agree that all dolls are terrifying. But there's just something about baby dolls that puts them on a Glass whole Glass porcelain creepy. dolls. I mean, the other How's that moving its hand up? There's, like, no string or anything. Turn into a baby straight out of someone's nightmares. That is so creepy. So, yeah, with that said, this one has got to be one of the worst. Because it's completely <laughs> naked, and its pain is cracked. And its arms and legs are super dirty. I think it looks really old. Not just that, but its right arm moves on its own, almost as if it's reaching out to grab you. Ooh. I'm not gonna lie, it's super spooky, but I also think it's kind of the owner's fault, because picking up a super old doll from a jumble sale is like horror movie 101. You Me every other it. weekend when I find a anyway, scary doll. Mine! Have gonna have to buy so that. There's nothing we can do except, well, maybe not make the same mistake, I guess. Yeah, the thing looks ancient, though. I mean, it's definitely moving on its own. There's no string, there's nothing attached to that. You can't really make up the movement of a hand up and down like that. That's just too weird for me. I don't see anything attached to it all and that thing does look old so whoever owns this is in for it at night that's for sure. Number three. Most people have been spooked by a doll in the house as a kid but that fear yeah. usually wears off as an adult unless you're these guys and have to deal with something scary as this. I mean these guys were so suspicious of their 100 year old doll that they set up a camera. 100 year old the doll? And when they watch back the footage they weren't disappointed. That thing's so like, old. Like it starts out with some stuff that could just be random. I wonder where like, they got it. Drop a little more to the side or the doll shifts one way or the other. But pretty itself? soon it looks straight up possessed. I mean it, like the thing is twitching or moving its arms up and down. It Almost is. Like whatever is inside of it is learning to control the doll. Ooh, so that's like, weird yeah, to think about. It's like, like trying to slowly right learn how to control it, whatever's come and get possessed you. I mean, it. So is this like footage that they recorded the doll overnight or what? This is creepy. I don't like the background music they put on this video. The way the doll is like slowly like shaking. <laughs> That thing's creepy, I don't like it. Honestly, the scariest thing about this video isn't even what's happening, it's the fact that's going on and nobody notices. No one noticed? This group are just happily filming themselves practicing their cup stacking, but if you watch the shelves at the back of the room, something way less normal is going on. Oh no. Like everything is cool for a while, but then So is the ones where they never notice it that are the scariest. Into a sitting position like it's rising up out of the grave. What? Honestly, it gave me a scare when I first watched it, and if we're being no real, way. I think it only gets creepier. With all that said, it might be best that way, because seeing a haunted doll come Yeah, they're literally just trying to stack cups, and she's really good at it, so you know the doll was not in on it. Like, they didn't have any movement or anything to do with that, because she's just trying to stack cups. That was a trend back in the days. I'm gonna watch the doll in the back cupboard and see if they're really right about this. Yeah, she's really good at stacking cups. What the? It literally did just sit up right. How? What? And they didn't even notice and they're just trying to stack the cups? Oh, heck no. I wonder if they noticed that. Well, they had to have noticed after because they put it on YouTube. That is so freaking creepy. Those poor girls. That said, these guys decided to contact the other side with this terrifying Oh, that's never a good idea. I probably don't need to tell you that it didn't go that well. Nope, it didn't. Basically, the more they played, so you don't the more play they woke up. Curse like, boards. I'm not even joking. It was twitching and looking around from the top of the shelf. Really? Even creepier, when one of the guys notices and looks around, it freezes in place straight away. Wait, the teddy bear? So, yeah, Obviously, the dude is creeped out and wants to bail, even after his friends have checked to see if the bear is safe. But as soon as oh, it is the teddy bear, he's walking back and forth. No way. So they're playing with the board, but they're not supposed to. And this bear is just chilling up there, and it starts moving. <gasps> Whoa! It really moved, like a whole lot. How the heck? That thing's whipping around. That should not even be physically possible. That's creepy. Look at the quality of this video too. They're always the old videos. And I think he noticed, and then as soon as he looked up, the bear stops moving. That is your sign, okay? That's your sign. If you guys ever wanted to touch one of those boards, now is the sign not to do it, okay? Don't do any of this, all right? So apparently this girl caught her haunted doll moving on camera. I have got to see this. So she has this little doll here, and it looks like it's split apart into pieces. Apparently, oh! Its eyes just opened! Yep, apparently its eyes can open, and the head can move on its own. That is so creepy. How is that possible? She also has these other dolls that blink and flutter. Um, I just have so many questions for this girl. Her haunted doll collection looks insane to me. She has so many dolls she's caught moving on camera all on their own in unexplainable ways. He falls when he gets excited. What? That's so crazy. Um, so this one waved at her somehow? No way. Is it actually gonna wave? I wanna see this happen. It's moving so slowly. It barely waved. This one broke a cookie. What? How can it break it that's scary 
It literally just broke a cookie. That one just fell. Oh my gosh, this one pulled her hair. Okay, this girl has the most insane collection of haunted dolls and toys I've ever seen in my entire life. Like, that's crazy. Also, guys, I want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, Shop Hero Legends. Shop Heroes Legends is a super immersive business simulation game where you are no longer the hero protagonist, but rather the friendly shopkeeper that makes or breaks each adventurer's fate. In Shop Hero Legends, you can play as the young and promising relative of the brilliant and courageous friends who pass this crafting business on to you, or expand your little shop and become the greatest shopkeeper across Aragonia. Recruit and build an undefeatable team of heroes and equip them with the coolest weapons. Honestly, whatever weapons weapon you can think of. Knives, swords, daggers, axes, fire guns, scepters, you name it. And they have it. Embark on an epic adventure filled with unknown challenges. Slay titans and drop epic loot. So what are you guys waiting for? Download Shop Hero Legends at the link down below and become the top shopkeeper in Aragonia. Check the pinned comments down below to get your redeem codes with fabulous decor items. By the way, you guys can also join the Shop Hero Legends Discord community where you can learn more about the game, share tips and tricks, post funny crafting videos or even just chat. Besides, the Shop Hero Legends official Discord is now hosting an Amazon card lottery. To join the lottery, just visit the official Discord server link in the pinned comment down below. And then just post a screenshot of your in-game store in the Discord community to win a free Amazon gift card. Link is down below in the pinned comment and description. This doll was kind of moving on camera. Okay, so this doll is like sitting in a chair. It looks like there's almost like orbs here apparently. I don't know. Let's look at the doll. It's kind of scary. Oh, it is moving. It just completely moved. What the heck? It literally just like completely tilted on its own. How is that physically possible? And the camera just keeps moving around. What are they trying to capture with the camera? Like, I wonder if that's like a webcam or what it is. That's so creepy. The way it just sits there. All right, that doll might be cursed. I caught my haunted doll, Abigail, moving again. Wait, it's moved before? That one actually looks like a doll that I own, to be honest. I have a doll that looks very similar similar to this one and mine is apparently haunted too. I want to see it move. Oh, it did move. It slightly moved into the box. That was weird. It just like slightly inched down a little bit. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was creepy. Haunted doll. Well, that's unsettling. She was caught moving on her own. She is moving. She's moving like this. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, her arms like went up and down. Oh my gosh, that's so creepy. Would I keep her? I don't know if I would keep her. If she's moving like that, she's gonna have to stay in the basement or locked in a cage for my own safety. Okay, so this was during somebody's investigation and they caught this doll moving during their paranormal investigation. The head just completely moved. Do you guys see that replay? Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is horrifying that the whole doll's head just completely slanted on its own, okay? That's creepy. All right, apparently this girl got this doll and it has a very dark thing attached to it, like a soul of something or an entity. So let's hear what she has to say. There is a dark entity attached to this haunted doll of mine. It is trying to escape its vessel. Ooh. I have soaked some red thread in some holy water. Creepy. Red thread symbolizes protection, good luck, and wards off I didn't know that. All of the rituals I do are about She's like stitching it up and everything. Everything has its meaning. I have been feeling very unwell lately. And it made her feel unwell? I have been told this entity is potentially trying to- That's kind of scary she has to do all this just to protect herself from the haunted doll. Even though the doll- Like this seems like a lot. This seems like some Annabelle stuff, like IRL. It's ready for its next chapter. That is so creepy. I can help it. She literally has it like around all these rocks and stuff. Like what is going on? I've been told to oh, Ouija boards are evil. From this doll. Jeez. As they can open up portals for communication with what the? Do not want to contact. Okay, that's actually terrifying that she has one doll that's so haunted that it can cause harm and damage to others. What? Okay, so this little girl apparently got a haunted doll and it started causing mischief around the house. So her mom does something at the end that's unexpected. So she likes the haunted doll. She feels connected to the doll. The mom's already concerned. You know, eventually she's bringing the doll everywhere with her. Her mom makes her bury the haunted doll. They have a funeral for it. You already know that's not gonna end well later on. The soul of the doll is probably gonna come to haunt the mom or somebody because it didn't end very good. This doll showed up at my house just randomly? What? Okay, then what happens? I thought it was just a sick joke. I was wrong. So it had to be done. Oh my gosh, she broke her haunted doll. This girl's 
was gonna get cursed for real. So there might have been something wrong with the doll. She's burning the doll! Was it really that haunted? Oh, I have a lot of questions for this individual. I want to know what happened with the doll, to be honest. I don't know if it deserved that. Maybe it did. I don't know. I got a few old dolls and one of them tried to kill me. What? What is she talking about? So she got those dolls and she ended up in the hospital? It was sucking the life out of me, it says in the caption. No way. What? I found out she is demonic. They had to lock her in a cage. Well, I choose life and you will stay in the cage so you can't hurt anyone else. Ain't no way she was that dangerous enough to pull her in the hospital. There's so many dolls out there that are very similar to Annabelle from the, the Conjuring movies. This is crazy. Recording myself sleeping next to my haunted doll? Wow, she lets her haunted doll sleep next to her at night? That is bold. Okay, her cat just moved onto the bed. Wait, the cat's scared of the doll. Oh my gosh. Why is it scared of the doll? Is it gonna do something? The cat's checking the doll out in the middle of the night. That's weird. It chewed on the dress. Is there a reason for that maybe? That is so creepy. Both cats are checking it out? Why are both of her cats checking out the doll? It must be haunted if they're both having to take a look at it. They see something that people can't. I wake them up and yeet them off the bed. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Why were they both checking out the doll? That's so weird. Something else gonna happen? Her hand started doing something weird. Okay, well that's weird. I would not sleep next to my haunted doll. This was a live stream. OMG, it actually looked at me. His doll looked at him? Ain't no way. He has like a spirit box attached to it. Is it saying it? <gasps> the head turned! I saw the doll's head turn like this. I could have thrown that doll turned its head at me. It did. He was right. Okay. Ain't no way. Okay, he got scared. He was like, I gotta swear that I... Yeah, the doll did move its head. That's the... Ugh, I don't like that. <laughs> Didn't expect this scare at 4 a.m. Not even at 3 a.m. This guy walks in to his dolls. <gasps> it moves completely on its own. I'm not waking up for that. I'm not waking up for that either, dude. Like, the doll literally went like this. You could see, like, around it. There was no strings or anything. Like, it was just sitting on a sofa. What? How is that possible? I found music that makes the doll bob her head. Wait, what? Those two sitting down together. So far, really, nothing has been caught. Uh, but I'm gonna try something different. What's he gonna do? I have put music on of people speaking. And the doll's moving! It's literally shaking its head. Do you guys see that? Look at that! The doll's like going like this! That's creepy to me. I don't like that. Okay, I don't know how these dolls be moving, but it's weird. Testing Walmart dolls for dark energy? Ain't no way. He brought a spirit box into Walmart. Do you, do you have a dark past or have you been killed by your <gasps> manufacturer? Or wait, was your manufacturer killed making you? Ain't no way. Oh! Are they gonna say anything? No response. That is too funny, honestly, though. Like, imagine there was do something you, connected to a doll a dark from the past store. Or... A spirit has left? What are they talking One about? One of my haunted dolls has decided to cross over. Make him leave? Is no longer with us. This is Edith, sad. and she was attached to this three-faced doll. I didn't really get much of a chance to talk about her in depth on my channel before she decided to cross over. Communicating Dang. with Edith was quite difficult and I really struggled to get any information out of her. She was really confused as to why she is so Wait, they there. have to cross over? What? So that's why they're like, they, they linger onto the doll till they cross over? I have so many questions. Okay, so this is one of the most cursed dolls ever. I've actually been to the museum it's at, but let's take a look at the story. Let me explain to you why this is a doll that you have to give verbal consent to see in person. You're also Scary. maybe wondering why her eyes are blocked out in these pictures. The we don't want to look at her eyes. by multiple curators over the last couple of decades, but it's unknown who the original owner was. What we do know is that the doll was sent away from its previous owner, and they claimed it to be the cause of some fear hallucinations and said That's that it was so crazy. on its own. Over the years, the doll has been subject to both historical and paranormal investigation, and there have been at least 80 documented cases of different wow. spectators looking into its eyes and claiming experiences of nausea, headaches, chest pain, even lightheadedness. 
I've actually seen this doll in person in Nevada, and you do have to give consent before you go into the room. It's optional to look at your Literally, room. when I went to Zach Baggins Museum, I skipped seeing this doll because I was so scared of it. It is no joke. I think it's probably the most haunted doll in that entire museum. It's scary, okay? So guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. Let me know in the comments what do you guys want me to react to or watch next on the channel and comment down below. Anyways, guys, also check out my other socials. I forgot to say that I do have an Instagram, a TikTok. It's all linked down below. And um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe so you guys don't miss out on my future videos. And um, if you guys are still watching to the end of this video, comment the magic word turtle to let me know that you watched to the end and I'll be responding to comments. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Bye.